Good day, global crypto enthusiasts. This is 88 Fantastic coming to you Sunday, May 20th, 2019. Just a quick look at our weekend, <coughs> excuse me, and what's been going on over the last few days. Same thing we've been talking about for, uh, for the longest time now with the sideways up action. And the thing to watch for now is we are seeing the, uh, the emerging trends uh, continue uh, where the altcoins are being pumped up uh, for a couple of days. And then uh, when the price of Bitcoin hits a certain number, Last week was 8,200. I'm going to assume this week it's 8,100. The next day or two, it's going to be 8,100. Then they'll dump it back again. And we keep seeing them taking their money out of all of the other coins. And they're simply putting it in uh, as much of it as they can back into Bitcoin and Ethereum. Like we've been seeing for quite some time now. So uh, some really crazy movement. Let's look over here on the other side. And we're going to check um, what's been happening to the actual market here. Today has been an absolutely insanely back and forth day of uh, profit taking. Let's do the one day here. And this is just today. So look at the amount of actual movement uh, between profit taking and uh, people getting crushed just, just today alone. So our peak today was earlier on, uh, say around the 256 mark, and then it dumped again. Then it crawls back up, dump, 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 dump. The same thing over and over and over. So here's your seven day chart. And what you see here is last week or the other day when we were on the 15th, uh, just about a week. Uh, sitting at our 263 and we had dropped back down to 223 and what i've been saying for for months on end is that april may june july are all going to be uh mere trending images the prices will be different but the trending is going to be exactly the same as april may june july of 2018 and that's why we uh chose last video to pick um the middle of september to be the lowest point we will ever see the actual market cap evaluation in the space so uh, let's have a quick refresh here. Every time we refresh, it seems uh, we're, we're going up two or three billion or down. So we're at 249.8. Where are we at now? It hasn't adjusted yet. So um, over at bitcoin.com, there are some really, really good articles for you guys to come and check out. Again, I don't click, I don't want to click through them and read through them. We just like to browse through them and make uh, some random, uh, generally asshole ish comments on some of these. Up to you, the viewer, to come in and have a quick peek. Warren Buffett isn't shorting Bitcoin. New crypto loan report concludes. Who gives a shit? The guy, the guy is is wealthy because he's been investing for fucking eighteen centuries for fuck's sakes, and he's missed the boat on as much as he's hit. Don't forget that he is highly successful and ultra wealthy. But don't forget he's been investing longer than you and me have probably been alive. So again, somebody that's completely irrelevant in the space and should should not have any. Uh, media coverage whatsoever with bitcoin having having a year away 60 percent think the price will go up from here Six, um, anybody that's in the space i guarantee you it'd be at 95 plus so who you're asking those other 40 percent we simply don't have a clue who would be uh not thinking with uh, the the, uh, the data that we've gotten for uh, the last couple of years so holders gonna hodl most of bitcoin supply didn't move since 2018 um, again, um, most of the Bitcoin hasn't moved since uh, 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 the 2011, 12, 13. A lot of that Bitcoin is still there. And if you ever want to go and look, you can actually go and see what every wallet that Bitcoin's ever had, what they actually have in it. So it's not like it's a secret. And it actually shows you um, activity time, when it's been moved, when it hasn't been moved. Um, you know what? We could do something like that right now. So right there along, that shows you the chart. This is current right now. That's just crazy when you look at it. So that's a chart for you guys to look at. And then if you want, it comes down here and it can just tell you a lot of these. So right there, that's the Bittrex gold wallet, Wallabies, Binance, Bitstamp, and then private owners, right? But it shows you the ins, the outs, and who hasn't moved. And some coins haven't touched, right? A last in so you could actually check when the last time somebody put something into their wallet and when the last time somebody took something out of their wallet so again i've always said you know this there's nobody we're in such an open space with the internet and with google and the things we can ask every bit of information is at your fingertips as a regular fucking joe blow you just have to have the balls and the backbone to actually go in and look at something to prove that you're right or prove that you're wrong and that's why I keep doing up these videos and I keep telling you I'm here to help uh, new people coming to this emerging space. But I've got no time for fucking dummies. I will punish a dummy in the blink of an eye. I'm just so sick of it.
it's all right here for us. Everything's right here. Coin check. I'm coming. Anything you want. You want to learn something about Bitcoin? Come and click on Bitcoin. Everything is here. This is hands down. Hi, cryptocurrency fans. Here are some daily statistics. After we pause that. And that's another great feature that we, we talked about about coin checkup the other day. Every day they update. Um, generally, for my guess, it's at least the top 25, if not the top 50, if they have time. So it's absolutely fantastic. Everything you want here, the algorithm, it's trading history, it's predictions, it's markets, it's, it's got everything. So hands down, the best site. Now let's give this bad boy a refresh and see where we're at. We just dumped another 500 billion. So anyways, I've been watching Hi, this. Hi, cryptocurrency fans. Oh, Here are some dude. daily statistics for... Sorry, I won't do that again. <laughs> we'll just get right off of that. I'll go right back to the market. But anyways, this today alone, Sunday, uh, May 20. What a crazy day. We've been going back and forth between uh, 243, I do believe. Uh, let's just do one day. Well, let's do the last seven days on here and see what it looks like. So that's us for, for the last week. Like, look how crazy that is. And then again, if you take this chart and you pump it into April, May of 2018, it's exactly what we've been talking about it. Um, we're at half the market of last year, but we're in the exact same trend. And what does that mean? The same people that punished people for profit in this time zone last year, when smart money came into uh, the space in early April before consensus and then beat the shit out of everybody from $475 billion all the way back to $309 billion. That's exactly what's happening right now. It's the same trend, and it's the same very wealthy people trading and kicking everyone's ass. And like I've always said, don't forget, for something, when somebody's had a successful trade in here, there's probably nine, nine and a half people that just got their ass kicked too, right? So people are slowly starting to learn, keep a little bit, maybe trade a little bit. But the more you keep it, the more support we have and the stronger this market gets moving forward. So... That's all I got for you guys today. I just wanted to come and show you a couple of quick tips here on how to look at the wallet addresses and the sideways up, sideways down. Um, the war today with the altcoins being pumped up and then bled out right back into BTC and uh, Ethereum. And like we're thinking, um, possibly that um, 8100 might be the contract price right now where we see um, Bitcoin uh, maybe scale back later on tonight. So that's what I've been noticing lately in the last couple of days is we're... It's, it's the same trend. We're getting up to that um, 81, maybe a little bit over 8,100. And then it just instantly dumps all the way backwards to uh, around the 77, 77, um, 7,700 to 7,750 mark. And then it piles right back up, pumps all the altcoins up again. And then they hammer the altcoins and put it right back into Bitcoin and Ethereum. So same things just keep happening. Um, it's super easy to look for. So that's one I come and show you guys how I'm looking at it. Um, and that's all about I got for you guys for this weekend update. And as always, uh, be careful, be safe out there. Always double check that address bar before you hit, hit that enter button. And this is 88 Fantastic showing you how to take a bite out of the cryptocurrency market. Take care, y'all.